Hello and welcome to my channel. I've decided to create a new series of videos where I start from scratch and create the free code camp Pomodoro Clock in React. Specifically, in this tutorial series, not this video, but the entire series, I'll be standing up the React application with Create React App, integrating the free code camp test suite tool, building the, uh, the Pomodoro clock using React, styling the Pomodoro clock with Tailwind CS, CSS, adding TypeScript to the project, and deploying it on both Heroku and Netlify. In this specific video, I'll be standing up the a new React application with Create React App to get a development environment running, and using the free code camp test suite tool to pass, let's say, at least one test. Let's get started. Open up your tutorial and go into the folder wherever you keep your practice projects or your projects. For instance, for video tutorials, I like to keep all my projects in a folder called lessons. Now in this folder, go ahead and type npx create react app Pomodoro clock. Pomodoro clock will be the name of our project and the name of our directory. Go ahead and click enter and let everything install. Everything's installed. Now let's go into our Pomodoro clock folder. From here in this directory, we can stand up our development environment to see the application template that Create React App has given us. To start the development environment, let's run npm run start, or in my case, since I like to use yarn, yarn start. If you started the development server correctly, your terminal should say you can now view Pomodoro Clock in the browser, and your browser should look something like this. Let's open up the code in VS Code, or your favorite text editor, and play with the development server. I want to show you how it hot reloads. Open up your terminal, open a new tab, and type in code dot, and that'll open the folder that you're in currently. Take your editor, move it to the side, and let's play with it side by side with our open development React server. Go into the source folder, go into app.js, and edit the code here. So I would say, hello world, hello YouTube. Save it, and you'll see that the development server automatically reloads with all the changes we make. Awesome. The last thing we want to do is add the free code camp test suite into our application. So let's go here into the free code camp spec for the build a Pomodoro clock project and scroll all the way down to the bottom. At the bottom, you'll see a link to the test suite bundle. Basically, if you visit this link, you won't be able to read it, but it's minified JavaScript that runs the free code camp test suite. Highlight the link, copy it, and go back into your project. In your project, open public index.html. For brevity, I'll delete all these comments here to make it easier to read, but of course, you do not have to. Place your cursor right before the closing body tag and write script source equals and the link that you copied into your clipboard. Save your file and let's go back here into our Create React App application. You'll see that the test suite is inserted into our application. We can run tests, see that we passed one test, but we're failing all of these, of course, because we ha are yet to start coding our application. I do want to end this video with at least one passing test. That way you can see how the test suite works and how you can go ahead, move forward with this project and pass tests yourself. The first test reads, I can see an element, so any element, with the ID of break label that contains a string. So my thoughts is writing any element, I'll use a P tag, with the ID of break hyphen label with any string. I'll go back to my React application here, create a P tag with the ID of break label, and it'll have a string inside of it called break. I'll save it, go back to my application, 
run the tests, and you'll see now I have this first test passing. After this video, I suggest trying to go in yourself and have these tests pass. This video is meant to get you started with Free Code Camp, the Pomodoro Clock, and the Free Code Camp Test Suite. Hopefully, I achieved that. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please click that like button. Please click that subscribe button. Please follow me on Twitter, Dev.2, or Instagram. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below or tweet me at Arian Jabari. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.